Good morning. Today we're going to continue our discussion on arthritis. Remember we talked about there's two groups of arthritis. Osteoarthritis, which is the OA, which is that wear and tear on the bones, the cartilage wearing down. The other group is the systemic arthritis, which is your rheumatoid arthritis, your RA, your sclerodermas, your lupus, that whole area. Remember with this group, today we're going to group them together, arthritis. And with these patients, the goal with them is to, one, ease joint pain. They may have pain because of the wear and tear of the arthritis. They may have pain because of the synovial fluid and the swelling going on in the hand, but we want to decrease the pain. We also want to instruct them to use larger muscles whenever they can. Body mechanics to save your back, you use your legs. Arthritis, if I can use my bigger arm muscles instead of my little finger and thumb muscles, I want to encourage that. We want to also maintain good joint alignment whenever possible, a nice neutral wrist position, back or knee position. So today we have products that are used in the ADLs, our activities of daily living. I chose several here that I think are a really good variety of what these patients may be using. I tried to pull mostly North Coast products, but I threw in some other ones that I really like to use with patients. A really good product is a bath bench. I have one right here. This is our Norco bath bench. This is the bench without a back. They do come with backs. There are other brands that we carry. There's also the transfer benches that go over the bathtub. These are nice because patients that have arthritis in their knees, hips, or maybe back, they have weakness. They can't stand the whole time in a shower. They get easily fatigued. If they can sit down, they can rest their joints, rest their muscles, and then have the energy to do the showering. While they're in the shower, what works really well also is to use a bath sponge. This is the Norco bath sponge. This one works, again, if I can't reach, I have shoulder arthritis, my hip, my knees, I can use this to reach down and wash my legs. Sometimes we will heat this as therapists and do a bend in it so I can get around to my back so I don't have to do the reach. An improved product from this one now is our Norco bath kit which comes with several pieces, similar to the St. Joseph's bath kit, but this is now our Norco brand. It comes with two bath sponges and two of these little foot sponges. Again, sitting down, you now have the ability to reach down. You put this between toes so you can clean them. You have a nice brush here, which works really well on the heel to scrub and to clean. You can also use the sponge on this one if you would prefer. Really nice for reaching when you have tight, sore, painful joints. Along with the washing, now with the dressing, a dressing stick works really well. This is a shorter length that comes in a longer length. This end has two hooks. This one can be used for putting on a sweater, a cardigan type sweater. You hook it around the sweater. I take this and I can put it over my head and pull it around myself. So again, I don't have to do the reaching. This end is really good if you want to get hangers out of a closet. You can reach out and use that to clip the hanger on it. This end originally was used with women that wore dresses and had the zipper down the back. We would put a little loop of monofilament and they were able then to attach this to it and then pull it up the back. Works great. An improved product over this one is our Norco Dress Ease. What this has is a nicer grip on the handle. It's built up, it's cushy, which makes it really comfortable to hold, again, especially for those arthri arthritic hands. It has the S here, rubber on this end, you can reach out and grab something, blankets in your bed and pull them closer. You can still use it to reach the hangers in your closet. On the other end now has a shoehorn. If you're sitting down to get dressed because you can't reach, a shoehorn works really well. Again, sitting, reach down to put your shoe on. Nice product. So let's move to the kitchen now, look at some products we can use there. Opening bottles can be very difficult. If I take it and I start turning, I put pressure on my thumb. If I go like this, I'm putting pressure on the fingers. For rheumatoid arthritis, this is very painful because it encourages those fingers going towards the little finger. To do it better, one, I can take and turn this way using bigger muscles, 
or I can use the Good Grips jar opener. This works great. It has teeth along the side here. It opens a water bottle all the way up to a mayonnaise jar. It has the Good Grips handle, larger, more comfortable for that arthritis hand. I take it, I slide in until the teeth grab, and then I turn. You notice as I turn, I'm using the larger muscles in my hand, my forearm. Works really well. I also end up with small bottles. Pill bottles are really difficult. A lot of them you have to push down and turn, which makes it very difficult. We have the Medi-Grip bottle opener with magnifying glass. This works really nicely because one, a lot of people with arthritis tend to be a little bit older. The vision isn't as good as it could, should be. You first can read the bottle on the side of the magnifying glass. Once you know you have the right product, you set it down. The inside has different grip sizes from the bottles. I also have used this on the Gatorade. You're going to take it, you're going to push down. Once it fits, again, you turn. Allows me to use those larger muscles and not the little ones in my hand. Scissors can be very difficult because every time I go to open a scissor, I'm using the pressure on the thumb small joints. The scissors, this is the Fiskar scissors, they spring open. We carry several different brands of the spring-loaded scissors. They spring. I don't have to use my thumb at all. When I squeeze with my fingers, it springs back open again. Has a lock to keep it closed. Very nice product. Cutting, if I take a knife, typically I take one. My wrist is at a poor angle, which puts more stress on the thumb area. The ergonomic Swiss knife works well. I take this one. By holding it, now when I put my hand down, you can see I have a nice neutral position. And then when I cut, I can use the larger muscles in my arm as opposed to using the little ones in my hand. We have the Xylix five-way opener. I left the label on here so you can see the five different ways to use it. It opens different size bottles. It opens the spaghetti jars that you pop open. It has the opening for cans that you can flip top here variety, and these are the bottle cap opener. A good little product, again, a nice grip size. You can use the larger muscles and not such the small ones. I think of some of the arthritic ladies, yes, I'm going to kind of generalize here, that have the tight shoulder joints. They're not as strong as they used to be. They like that nice cup of warm tea. The thumbs up cup works really well. You put your hands on either side, the little grip here, the thumb rests on, you comfortably can pick it up and drink the tea. Makes it easier, again, two-handed use. Car keys, house keys. To grab a little key, it's very difficult because it's a little pinch. What we have is our key turner. This holds three keys. You take the knob, you loosen it up to place the key in. Once it's in there, when I put this in my house, what I'm gonna do now is turn and you can see I'm using the larger muscles in my arm and not those little ones in my fingers. Works real well. For handwriting, a good one to use with handwriting is our writing bird. This is used for the right or left hand, comes with the pen, you tighten the screw to hold it securely. What you do at this point is you set it down, you just comfortably place your hand on it and you write. Again, large muscles. I'm not doing that tiny little pinch that can irritate the hand. And I just write. Now, these are several examples I have of products for the arthritis patient. We have many more. We can go through more. But this is a start I want you to work with. Thank you.